Uh, I'm writing a paper on climate change for biology class. The first place I look for information is epa.gov because there are a lot of um, a lot of research on the topic on that website, and it's credible because it's an agency that specializes in the topic. And I will use the search term climate change in the search bar that is available at the top of the page. I choose by topic. Search. Ah, here it goes. All right, it took me to a climate change to the general page. And I'm going to choose Greenhouse Gas Emissions, the link, because that's what it's basically the source. And what are greenhouse gases? And the link I chose is Sources of Greenhouse Gases because it has a lot of bullet points and some graphs to make it easier to understand and has a lot of useful information and um, I will bookmark this so that way I'll know where it's at and I probably will not change any of my terms because there's a lot of different results on that page anyway so but I will probably go to Google and try to find some outside sources besides you know just besides EPA just to give a little variety and for Google I will search effects of climate change because that it'll, I feel like it's a better better term for Google And for, for this, I chose climate change impacts from the Environmental Defense Fund because they're an authority on the topic. And again, I will bookmark it so that way I can go back to it. And the next place I'll go is Google Scholar, so I can find some authorities, some peer-reviewed authorities on the topic. And I'll search climate change. And it's not helping me, so I'll change the results to effects of climate change. And I'll change the date range to 2011 to 2015, because most of these are old.
uh, is a source of journal of mountain ecology. Appears to be peer reviewed. And PDF. Ah, uh, yeah, this is good. Hey, this is a PDF file. I will download it so I can come back to it later. Yeah, move this to the desktop. And uh, I think I'm done here. <laughs>